Hi, this is Jackie Hoffman for Broadway.com, and here in my dressing room is a typical pile of fan mail, what every performer waits for. Fan mail! Jackie's got her fan mail! Let's open it now! Here we go. This is from Mr. Patrick from Lebanon, Pennsylvania. Ooh, well, that's the only letter I'll be getting from Lebanon. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Here's someone who's not green. It's like three words on a page. And how many pages are there? Hello, I adore your Broadway.com video blog. Thank you, Patrick. Please continue making me laugh. Aw, happy Easter. Well, boy, you got me, Peg Patrick. Lebanon and Easter. Now, interestingly enough, here's another letter from the same person. This could turn out scary. We may not all live to see episode five. Even thicker, folks. What's this? Uh, you, uh, oh my goodness. You asked the woman in the theater who recognized you if she was gay. Only in the moment, honey. I am gay. Oh, shocker. Well, Patrick, now you're coming out to the entire Broadway community. And love the city. Any second home. Anyway, best wishes. Have a great run. Keep up the blog. Thanks, Patrick. And here's another letter. We're brimming with three. This is from Joseph Dye from Clarksville, Tennessee. Let's see. We're getting them from all over the country. Clarksville, Tennessee. Wow. What is this? It's a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, boy. Several envelopes. Oh, for B.B. Newworth. For Nathan Lane. Anything for me? No. Okay. I see what's happening here. This person is a typical fan letter writer who is now using my bottom status on the totem pole to do him or her the favor of getting them B.B. Newworths and Nathan Lane's autograph. Well, you know what, pal? I'm in a position now where I'm probably gonna do it. I just wanted to write you and thank you for such an amazing performance of Xanadu. A few years ago it was the summer of my senior year and my last trip to New York for now and it was great. If you could, would you mind passing this playbill along? Here we go. To Nathan and Bebe, as well as you, in as well as you. Oh, thanks, please. Also, I've enclosed playing cards. If you could sign these as well, I'd appreciate it. I'm having actors sign it for a charity. I'll be selling them on eBay and then giving the proceeds to BCEFA. I've also included a photo of us. Uh-oh. Again, thank you for making me laugh, and uh, uh, you've heard that before. You're a fan. Okay, well, let's find uh, this picture. No picture in here. Okay. Thank you. Little section we call fan mail. Here's what one of our uh, children, the Pugsley Understudy, has put up a map of these great United States. And let's see, we can zoom in and see where people in the show are from. Okay, there's a Beautiful uh, Morgan James and she's from Idaho. Uh, let's see, here's a, uh, I think this is Katie, our child wrangler, and she is from, I believe, San Francisco. And uh, I, of course, am from the great state of New York and my picture is nowhere near here. That's, a, that, that's okay, I'm sure, I'm sure they're looking for it right now. You know, not many people know this, but our very own Lurch, Zachary James, is quite the fashion bug. Hey, Zach. Hey, how are you? I'm good. Why don't you show the uh, Broadway.com viewers a few of those shoes you've bought? Oh. He's just, he's the Imelda Marcos of the company. Well, most excitingly, I just got these today in the mail. Um, this is the Stacey Adams Madison boot. 
I got it on Endless.com, free overnight shipping. <laughs> That's what they call the desert boot. That's a very popular shape. Very nice. If you hold this up to the camera, we've got like a two, we've got like a two-tone thing here. It's wow. the same color, but a two different wow. textures. And of course, that's a whopping size. Fourteen. 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 Howdy. Yeah. Um, Ooh, all those drag queens. You're out of shoes. <laughs> These are the ones that didn't make. Whip it. Oh, <laughs> working at the car wash, girl. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I bought these for opening night, but I, I got them and I wasn't pleased. They were just, Ooh, uh... It's a family affair! They were too big. They were too big? Why, are they a 15? Uh, they're 14. They just, you know, the 15 they're 15, but that's a... foot look bigger than it is. So oh! We don't like that. Thanks for the fashion tour, Zach. You're welcome. I'm looking at what our crew is reading, and it looks like the Scientologists have infected the theater. <laughs> Dianetics by L. Ron Hubbard. This is the original 1874 edition with uh, Jerry Garcia on the cover. They're steaming Nathan Lane's jacket. That's right, folks, you saw it here first. Nathan Lane's jacket being steamed. This is the Gomez Adams overcoat. And uh, this is what he wears when Gomez dies. Oh, I just gave away the plot. This is, <laughs> this is what I call a whole lot of lurch. Wah, 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 wow. Ah. Yeah. You like that? Endless lurch. <laughs> I can hold my coffee mug with my toe. Wow. Lurch can drink coffee with his feet. Wow. And it's holy cow. Boy, you missed your calling. Is Sideshow still playing? <laughs> this is Barrett's actually eating the grandma pizza. This is the grandma slice of pizza from Pateria's Pizza next door, and it's actually called the Grandma Pizza, named, of course, after yours truly, Grandma from the Adams Family. How is it, Barrett, to take that first bite? I haven't taken the first bite, but I can do that for you right can now. Can Broadway.com witness the first bite of yes. Grandma if, Pizza? If they want to watch me eat, sure. <laughs> I think they want to watch you do anything, from what I gather our demographic is. <laughs> How is it, Barrett? There's only one thing better than this Pizza Pizza. Yes? Jackie Hoffman's CD, Live at Joe's Pub. Oh, thanks, Barrett. Does it, does it taste all grandma-y? Does it taste like vitamins and Metamucil and prunes? Well, 